guys so today I thought I'd get you started on another trick which um, doesn't really have a name but it's biscuit on the nose or holding still anything like that but what I'll do is I'll, um, I'll show you how to build it up nice and slowly from the start and um, we'll get you to where uh, my dog's are at the moment. Alright, bye guys. So with this one you want treats that are flat, not ones that are circular and just going to roll off his nose. You want something that's easy to work with and just going to lay on his nose so you're not faffing around too much getting the treat on the end of his nose. Secondly, you want to be able to hold your dog and him not worry about what you're doing. So you want to be able to put your hand around his nose so that you've got a good grip and him not worry. Yeah, I can... You're not getting a treat just for that. Come here. He's warm and he wants to pan. But I can hold him, I can hold him still so I can put the treat on the end and then I can let him go, okay? So first up what you need to do is teach your dog still or wait so that he needs so that he remains still while you put the food on his nose and then take your hand away before he then tries to get the food from his nose. So having your dog sit in front of you. Go to sit. Not at the moment, please. Good. So you want to take hold of his nose. Ah. Good boy. Want to put that treat there, take it away, and give him a biscuit. Good boy. Hold his nose, treat there, give him a biscuit. So I started to balance the treat, take my hand away, and then bring bring the hand back to take the treat off of his nose. Charming. So still is the command. I'm balancing the treat, still good boy, and then he gets the treat afterwards. Watch me. Still. Good boy. Good. Good boy. Good. So once you've got the hang of that, you're then going to start taking this second hand away. Little bits at a time. Do not rush to take this hand away. So still. Asking him to watch me just with a hand signal. Now I'm going to slowly move this down here. Good boy, well done. Good. So I just took my hand just a little bit away from him and then brought it straight back. I'm not building it up too fast. Not expecting too much of him at once, even though he already knows the trick. So I'm holding his nose, treats on there, asking to watch. I'm slowly going to move his hand down. Watch, still. Good boy, and then he gets that food. Very good. So the next step is taking the hand away completely. Ooh, it's a big one. You ready? Same to the still. 
treat on the nose. Watch me. Still. 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 So good boy. Well done. Don't push your timing. If you think you've got three seconds, great. Do three seconds, then go back and do it again, then try for five. So make sure you build up each step nice and slowly from holding on to the muzzle to putting the treat on, taking it off, to taking your hand off completely. It's all little steps, but if, it, if you build it up gradually, then your dog will be able to do that trick with that. If your dog follows the treat as you put it on their nose, then that's the bit that you're gonna need to practice more and more. So, <laughs> and also try with a le uh, with a duller treat, so a biscuit from their, from their evening meal, their, their breakfast, rather than something extra tasty like um, ham or cheese, something like that. So use something dull to put on their nose and give them either something else on your pocket that's extra special, or give them that biscuit that they've got off of their nose if, if, if that's what they want to work for. So once you've got them holding it on their nose without any help from you holding them, holding their nose, then uh, you need to move up to them being able to flick it up and catch it or roll it off and catch it themselves. So that is the next bit and I'll just show you how you get onto that bit. Good, so holding him, putting the treat on, asking him to watch, I'm gonna take my hand away and then I'm gonna ask him to get it, get it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Okay, we'll try that again. So he's got a big one on his nose. Ask him to watch. Still. Still. And get it. That's it. Good boy. Okay, so I pretend to chuck a treat up and above his head, which caused him to flick his nose up. So holding his nose. Ask him to still and watch. And I'm gonna pretend to chuck a treat. Oh, good boy, almost. Almost, good boy. You ready? So I'm gonna hold his nose. No. Hold his nose, put the treat on there ready for him. So still, watch me. Watch me. Ready. Catch it. Oh! So you can see how that progresses, just chucking a trip pretend treat up and above to give him the action and the pretend treat then becomes a real one as his one that he flicks up above from his nose falls down for him to catch. Wait, still, ready, steady, catch it! <laughs> Do you need a heavier treat? I think I've gone in your floof. I think the dried fish are too light so they're not actually flying where I want them to fly so I'm going to try with a heavier biscuit. A biscuit on the end. Watch. Still. Ready. Ah, still. Ready. Steady. Catch. Oh, you had the flick. Treat on the end. Ah. Still. Still. Watch. Watch. So they're both getting the flicking action now. It's just a case of them being able to catch it. <laughs> uh, using a heavier biscuit type treat will obviously go up and um, it will go up with enough force that they'll be able to find it and catch it. Whereas uh, the dried fish treats that I was using before are too light. So they're most likely just being flung backwards without them having a second, a second chance to try and be able to um, catch it mid air. So, uh, pick your treats for this one. Make sure they're obviously flat and they can stay on the nose without rolling off and um, and they get good hang time once they've been flicked up. <laughs> Don't, didn't think I'd ever say that on camera. Um, <coughs> hope, you, uh, hope you enjoy that one and it's um, if you can get it on camera then that's even better. But I'll um, look forward to seeing those and um, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you on the next video. Bye guys.